Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a plan with me in my horizontal planner for the week of August 29th through September 4th. And for this spread, I don't know if I've already posted my wellness video or not. Here's a preview if y'all haven't seen it. But I wanted to bring that same aesthetic into the first week of the month and I used um, the floral media journaling kit from Crafty Planner Queen so this was the other part of the kit that I used on the other spread but I had a lot left over so I wanted to use the rest of that and then I'm going to pair it with maybe botanicals and papillon as well as some washi tape. I wanted to do that junk journaling um, vintage vibe so, with that, let's get started. I'm going to first start off with trimming out this scrapbook-esque type of sticker. It's like a background type thing. I don't know. I like to tear them up and use them throughout the page. So, I'm going to do that real quick. Okay, so I have it torn or cut out. Now, what I was thinking is maybe I normally do it in the corners when I use this type of scrap paper, but I'm thinking I might want to do it, do something down the middle. So I'm going to tear it. Ooh, that's some bad tearing. Okay, so something like this maybe. Something like that. I think I'm going to take this up a little bit more though. There we go. Okay, perfect. So I don't know what all I'm going to add, but this is going to be my base. Okay, so they're all punched out. Now let's get to the fun part, and that is adding all of the layers to this spread. So I pulled Papillon because I used a lot of the butterflies, and I still wanted to incorporate some of them. And while I was flipping through it, it has these awesome daisies that are kind of like this. So I think I might incorporate that as well. And then I need to think of some boxes to use. I can also do a quote. I'm going to pull this one out so I don't forget it. Ooh, these could be fun. I'm going to pull that one out too. Yeah, I don't want to bring too many colors in, but I do want to bring in some boxes. So I might just go with some Mojo Jojo plans. That could be fun. I don't know if I want to add pink, but I'm going to pull it off to the side just in case. I need to plan out these layers. Let's start on this side, and I'm also going to grab Mojo Jojo's brown boxes. And I think I'm going to do maybe a double 
wide. What color do we want to use? This lighter tan. Or this darker. And I like this lighter one. So, thinking, I want to start off with something over here. And let's take some of this journal tape and tear it. Save the extra and I guess I'm just going to do some layering right there. Okay. And I have this girl or this girl I could use over here. And I think I like her right there. I'm going to trim off the bottom here so she can go flat against the bottom of the page. vibes. Okay. Really want to do some layering with that. Let's look at some. Oops. I want to see how this looks if I layer it underneath here. Just to add some extra texture. I think that's fun. Okay, we need to look at butterflies. Let's pull out the butterflies and the florals that are in here. So You know what? I don't want to cover up the side of that box. I like being able to see it since I'm covering up that side already. But maybe we can put this one behind her. Okay. Since we added blue, I'm going to remember to try and put some blue elements over there but butterflies that's where we were what options do we have we have some greens do we want to do greens oh I forgot about these look at me see this is what happens when I don't pre-pull my stickers out, I always forget about some stickers. Okay. Is that all the butterflies? No. Okay. I really like this brown one. And this one. had a mind of its own. Okay, now I want to remember that I want to do the decor kind of going that way. So, let's 
figure that out. Maybe I need to find something to kind of connect these up here. I don't think I'm going to use this now. Let's see what we got. Definitely want to use that one. What girl are we going to use over there? Maybe her with another brown box. Definitely going to need a box here since I'm covering up the majority of Monday. Okay, let's grab this other washi tape. Some layering on top there. Okay, we need something right here in the middle. I have this one floral. don't know if I want to use that as a connector or not. Okay, change of plans. Let's try this one. Looks kind of awkward, but maybe we can just add some butterflies around it. Let's go grab some more. Okay, we need a different kind. Want to do this yellow one? I mean, there's yellow on the page. That's so pretty. Okay. I think I want to go back and add a yellow one on this other side. Now, I do want to add this blue in here. Oh no. I want something along the bottom. I feel like it needs something to ground it. I have this key. Maybe we can do some washi if that doesn't look right. I don't really like the key. Let's try just some washi, maybe. I'm going to do it inside the box. Okay, 
let's cut this apart and see how we're looking. I think I'm liking it. I feel like we need more butterflies on this side. Where though? Be right there. Let me get my punch and punch out these holes. This is what we're looking at so far. Got stickers everywhere. Okay, I didn't end up putting a quote, so maybe this quote can go right here. And there's one more of those quotes in Papillon. It says, Heart of Gold. So, maybe we just do it down here over this washi. Okay. Now, of course, part of me really wants to add some more to this page. But I don't know that I should. Because I like the balance of it. There's so many pretty stickers that I really want to Add. Mm. Okay. Let's just lightly put this one down and then see what options we have for this side. I do have that box that's too long. Let's go back in Papillon. We have this other one. It doesn't have any gold foil to it. Or no, we have this one. Okay, what do we, oh, no, I'm nervous. I want to put it down. Let me grab some wax paper to try to plan this out. I don't know. I really do want to add stuff, but I don't want to take away from this whole thing I got going. I honestly don't think this one's too distracting down here in the corner. Hopefully I end up liking it enough to keep it because I don't think it's going to come back up. Okay, and then since we did end up putting that one down, I'm just going to go through the other side. And one thing I didn't go through is the botanicals. I'm wondering if I could have found something in here. So you have these pretty blues, but it's a different shade. Oops, no. All right, we're just doing it, I guess. We're sold on that. <laughs> okay. 
anything else. I'm thinking I'm gonna, oh my gosh. No. Ugh. Hopefully I like this one because it's not gonna be able to come back up. So I'm going to put this one up here in this corner. Add a little bit more washi. I feel like that's too dark, but I also feel like it needs some element from here. Why not? And it's got butterflies on it already, so I think, oops, sorry. I think I'm going to call this spread done. Let me know what you think about this spread down in the comments. If you're interested in this sticker kit from um, Crafty Planner Queen, I'll have that link down below. I also have a discount code you can use if you're interested in purchasing anything. Please consider liking and subscribing so you can see all my future videos. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye.